The old Nintendo 3DS is a very unique device. It has great graphics and great gameplay. But how durable is it? Let's find out. For starters, it looks like that this DS is made up of just one material, plastic. So let's find out what it really is made out of. To do this, I have a set of Mohs hardness picks that determine the hardness of the material. 2 to 3 would be about plastic, and 8 to 9 would be around sapphire or diamond. Here are the picks. Beautiful, ain't it? Let's test them. I'm going to start very basic. I don't have very high expectations for this DS since it was made so many years ago. So I'm going to start with a 2, move up to a 3, into a 4, and so on. Not very deep grooves at a level 2. Almost nothing. We move up to a level 3 and we start to see actual scratch marks. So we move up to a level 4 and we can see deeper grooves. Now that we've got the screen out of the way, let's scratch some of the base of the DS and see what that's made of. Bottom screen as well as top screen and base of the DS is also made of plastic. Front facing camera, as to my surprise it is made of the same material as the rest of the DS. Plastic. I had scratch marks at level 3 and even deeper at a level 4. Back facing camera, same as before, but this time it was actually a bit more durable than the front facing camera. More base testing and we can see that the base of the DS has fallen victim to a pocket knife which means that this is not a very strong material. A bit of scratching on the sharp edge of the knife just to see how well that the DS reacts to it. Seems to be a pretty weak material DS. I don't really have anything else to say about this. 